welcome. This time, the spread operator. I'm coming from an Android background, so I never heard of the spread operator before. But now I do, I find it pretty handy, especially for Flutter. So let's see why. Here in my, in my home widget, I have a scaffold and in the body, a list view. And the children of this list view should be based on some logic. So I made a method for it. It's called widgets based on logic. It returns a list of widget and for now, for demo purposes, a list style and a waste button. Nothing special. So I want to use this, these, this list inside the list view. So I would call my method right here. And now I get an error. The element type list widget can be inside the list type widget, which is correct. I'm opening here an array. And I'm saying, okay, put an array inside this array. This would not work. By removing this array block, everything should work just fine. Here we go. Hot reload. There we go. But what if this is not the only widget in this list view? What if there is something like a divider or another widget? It doesn't matter. Then it doesn't work because now I have, I, I say I have multiple widgets, but I can only return one array. So instead of doing this, I will put this back what I could do is I could do a for a for loop and just iterate through the uh, widgets and return them one by one this will work but it doesn't look nice it's confusing there's a lot of code I wish it could be better and it can with the spread operator so we'll go back here and what you need to do only three dots in front of the metal there we go and that's it now it would spread the list into the separate widgets and that's what it does and it's pretty damn handy and everything works just fine this is what i wanted to show you guys uh, check out my other videos and see you guys soon